So this is very important because most people don't understand that when we're eating, we are basically fat foraging and amino acid foraging. In other words, even if it's not conscious, we are eating until we trigger the activation of CCK. Now, there are other reasons why we shut down eating too. The volume of food in our gut can be large and we can feel very distended. That's the physical reason, obviously. But at a subconscious level, the gut is informing the brain via CCK and other mechanisms when we've ingested enough of what we need. So as you can see, feeding is an interplay between brain and body, and it's some of the micronutrients and even the breakdown of particular nutrients that's putting the accelerator or the brake on the feeding process. You are essentially trying to eat to get these nutrients, and then a signal can be deployed up to your brain that you're not really interested in eating that much more. There's one particular aspect of food that can powerfully impact CCK. And I think most people, I'm guessing 99.9% .9 of people out there are not aware of this. 